class. <laughs> Today we will be discussing the difference between a sans serif font and a serif font. Here's an example of a sans serif. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. Sans serifs like Futura here are fonts without serifs, the small projecting features at the end of letters. In contrast, here's Garamond, a serif font. The masculine, you're right, fuck. The up and down in victory. Why, 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 the super lazy dog. You'll notice the curvature on the letters in super lazy and wah wah. <laughs> Sarahs are better for longer reads, like newspaper articles. What was that for? cried the shitty dog. Please, <laughs> The handsome fox didn't say anything, he didn't have to. You know, cool when you see it. This was a cool fox. Class, do you recognize this font, Tom? Hey, Professor, what the hell is going on with these sample sentences? <laughs> oh, well, I wrote these. I really connected with the characters from the original sentence. <laughs> Just, I couldn't help but find myself affected by the dynamic between the characters. Much like the dynamic between fonts and their effect on words' meanings. For instance, here are a few more examples. After the embarrassing jumping incident from earlier, the dog's girlfriend wanted nothing to do with him. You can come with me. I'm going to Adrian Grenier's house, said the fox. After a nice evening at Adrian's, Tom Hardy was there. The dog's girlfriend and the fox made love under an old old tree. Okay. Who has a question about the font? And who has a question about the dog? Great, let's get back to it! What's wrong with me? thought the dog. Why am I so damn lazy? Maybe it's time for me to take responsibility for once in my life. And it was in this moment that the dog decided to go to the fight. <laughs> what are we seeing here? An emotional turning point for the dog. Yes, and the serif font time the Roman. <laughs> there was jumping again in the dog's life, but this time it was the lazy dog who jumped out of a war plane over Syria, <laughs> fighting for the United States of America. Yay! Yeah. It was in this way. <laughs> Shop in Connecticut with his beautiful horse boy, Isabella. He was with the limp now, but when children see him on the streets, they applaud. <laughs> the brown fox lost his money in a decorative quick scheme involving designer beats. He's traced with the dog's girlfriend, a distant hope you love. Karen? He whimpers as a jail cell. Karen? 